guys, so this tank actually arrived one whole day early than expected. I was expecting to be delivered on Friday the 2nd, but instead it showed up Thursday. It completely uh, took us off guard, threw us off guard, whatever. I had, my phone wasn't even on me. I was still cleaning up this area and apparently I missed like seven phone calls from the company. And luckily, I was in the garage when I was putting stuff away and I heard the sound of a big truck. You know, when they release their air brake and everything, they go, I was like, no way, is this happening? And it was, yeah. So anyway, uh, this is the um, video, the first video of the Cade build series. This one will be uh, me taking the delivery of it and doing a little unboxing, so to speak, unboxing and go over it slightly and then we'll dig deeper and we'll do everything legit, step by step. This is it. You ready to watch? Let's roll. guys so if you've made it this far into the video first off thank you but now I think that it's time that we agree on that this is a beautiful tank and let's dive into some dimensions so this tank is 36 inches long it is 28 inches wide and it is 24 inches tall this is a very good dimension for a tank it's perfect it's got a lot of room to play with, a lot of water volume, which brings us to, this holds 85.6 gallons in the display and then 105 gallons total overall with the sump. Also this glass is 12 millimeters or just about a half inch thick. It's also made of OctiClear glass. Super beautiful Cade. Now this tank also looks like it should be an all-in-one tank with the ATO reservoir being built into the back of the tank, but instead it actually plumbs down into a sump. Here you have your water level as well, sight gauge. And this tank even came with its own mesh screen as you can see to the side of it. Absolutely gorgeous tank. Now what I also like is that it includes all of the plumbing, everything that you need, including your ball valves. Now moving on to the stand, here's some quick dimensions. It is 36 inches long, it is 28 inches wide, and 36 inches tall. 
It even comes with 16 outlets for plugs along with switches to turn them on and off individually. A feature that I really, really like. Another feature I really like is that it comes pre-built in the crate. So you do not even have to start piecing things together like a puzzle or anything. The stand comes pre-built, ready to go. It even comes with an integrated leveling mat on top. And the sump comes shift and it is beautiful. Even has these removable media trays, which is really cool. But I'm gonna have to figure out how they're actually being used because I never really seen a setup like this. Also, the doors on all sides are tempered glass. Beautiful construct. Well guys, I hope that you enjoyed this video. I hope you were excited along with me. What's really awesome is that this is the Cade 900 Pro Reef Series 2 or S2. I'm one of the first in America to actually have one of these tanks. And it's exciting. We're one of the first in America to actually have these tanks and let's see what we can do and if you want to follow along in this build please do hit that subscribe button and hit this like button Sawfish tv ow you guys so real quick i just want to give a big huge shout out to algae barn and all the crew there everybody you know sean taj the owner of algae barn greg chernoff sean king robbie vice samantha obergis Everybody, thank you so much because this tank came all the way from Colorado to Alaska and they are the only distributors of Cade tanks. So go to CadeUSA.com, check them out. Yes, I know, this is post um, editing. So you get some behind the scenes shots on that. Peace.